my work is almost a mixture of self-portraiture and my own unconscious, but as well as tapping into collective images and or symbols or imagery that reoccur throughout different cultures. As the years have gone on, I've tried to reduce the amount of imagery used in the work, almost reduce the marks as well. I'm trying to get down to a simplified core of exactly what I'm trying to say. Typically, the works just come from a theme or an idea that I've just been regularly thinking about, and then an idea might emerge, and I typically put a note in my sketchbook or do a little drawing, and then it gradually evolves. What I found with my work has been how can I push the boundaries, almost disrupt how you typically view that medium. They're all very much taking mediums that are very precise and delicate and then disrupting it. They're brutal and violent, especially the sculpture works, but the forms within the work are always me. The anger and frustration is an external force. The process of the edition has been playing with screen printing and seeing what's possible with the medium. It was originally Polaroid that I then painted, scraped away, made marks, then a scan, and then now the scan has become a digital file that was screen printed. The original Polaroids were of tombs in Carrara, the city where the, the famously the marble came from for lots of the Roman statues. And of course, in your Carrara, the marble tombs are the ones that are raised above ground and they've got all the frontages. There was no way of getting up to it, so I had to walk from the town. It was about a 90 minute walk up into the mountains. And so initially it was a photograph of that, which I then painted at a life drawing class, referencing classical Greek and Roman sculpture. And I actually came back to the pieces months later, they all disintegrated, all the paint was peeling off the Polaroids. And so I was then interested in this idea that to express a small little drawing now only ever existed as this scan. Now all I've got is really a collection of pixels. What can you do with that? And then what can you play with that? And then now the scan has become a digital file that was screen printed. That digital file then has been taken, altered, reduced, and now it's almost gone from being a physical, digital, back to analog, back to digital. So the last process of it being screen printed, it now goes back to being a handmade process. So almost you've taken this thing that's gone through all these different processes, now it's being reduced once again and played out.